Hi guys, welcome back. And today I'm going to tell you all about when a ewe lamb is ready for mating. So when it comes to breeding your ewe lambs or making sure they are ready to be bred, there are a few things that you need to take into account. First of all, a ewe lamb should reach at least 70% of her mature weight. However, it is possible that some ewes are able to reach sexual maturity to be bred at an earlier stage because of their genetic advantage, the size of the animal and the nutritional feeding or supplementation they receive. Breeding your ewe lambs too early can cause detrimental uh, disadvantages to the ewe health-wise and reproduction-wise. These defects can lead to the damage of the reproductive system of the ewe and also cause permanent damage to her reproductive organs. As a rule of thumb, ewes are normally ready for breeding at the age of 9 to 12 months. So this will allow her to reach sexual maturity. It gives enough time for her reproductive organs to develop properly and thus making her ready to be bred. So essentially, when your uh, ewe lambs are ready to be bred, for a certain period of time, they would have been separated from your uh, market flock, which means that they were selected as replacements. So you would know exactly which ewes these are and with them you would continue to meet their nutrient requirements and boost their mineral and vitamin supplementation and have a good body condition score at the time that you want to join them to a ram. So once you've selected the group of your ewe lambs that are ready for breeding, uh, you would essentially separate them from the mature ewe flock because these ewe lambs for breeding are essentially still growing and what that means is they need extra feeding, extra nutrition, so they would be on a completely different ration than the rest of the flock. The risk of underfeeding these ewes for their first mating can cause problems during pregnancy or even at time of lambing. What you would find to be common in ewe lambs being pregnant for the first time is that when they lamb, they would give birth to mainly single lambs. However, twins and triplets are not uncommon. Um, but for the most part, they would have a higher percentage of bearing only one lamb. In, an important point to take into consideration is that you need to not focus too much on putting fat on your ewe lambs before breeding them for the first time. Rather look at increasing the overall frame of the animal. So to just increase the size of the animal with good nutrient, vitamin and mineral supplementation within the ration you are feeding them. All right guys, thank you for watching. I hope the video was useful to you. And if it was, like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.